For 80 years, Columbus Day has been a federal holiday here in the U.S., but the L.A. City Council has new plans now. That's right. From now on, the city is taking the honor away from Christopher Columbus. Kick on Eyes Peter Dowd is live in downtown Los Angeles with the details tonight. Peter. Jeff and Susie, there's no question the arrival of Christopher Columbus played a major role in history. There's even a statue of him here in downtown L.A., but the federal holiday that bears his name will no longer be recognized by the city of Los Angeles. Both outside and inside L.A. City Hall Wednesday, emotions ran high over Columbus Day. The council voted 14 to 1 to get rid of the holiday. And we will no longer stand for revisionist thinking, celebrating someone who was responsible for setting in motion the greatest genocide known in world history. Councilman Mitch O'Farrell, a member of the Wyandette Nation tribe, introduced the resolution two years ago. The second Monday in October will now be an official Los Angeles holiday commemorating indigenous, aboriginal, and native people. We need to celebrate the first people of these Americas, the people who are here before anyone else, celebrate their cultures, their religions, and their beliefs. But replacing Columbus Day drew opposition from many Italian Americans who view the day as a celebration of their national heritage because of Columbus's Italian lineage. And Potenza is the president of Federated Italo Americans. We supported that there would be a day for the indigenous people. We do believe that they should be celebrated. The hardest part was we didn't want it to be to replace Columbus Day. The only no vote came from Councilman Joe Buscaino, who is Italian American. The council rejected his motion to move Indigenous Peoples Day to August and introduce a new diversity day in October. Both he and Potenza do not believe Columbus should serve as a symbol of genocide and atrocity. I thought that that was unfair to pin 500 plus years of what has happened in our country on one man who actually opened up the doors and the gates for us to come over here. Columbus Day is still a federal holiday, but the city of Los Angeles now joins other cities, including Seattle and Minneapolis, in replacing Columbus Day with Indigenous Peoples Day. Back to you.